I promise not to take the elevator again, but mom insists on taking it again. It was making some weird noises. Here she goes. This is her thrill ride for today. It's not Dollywood. There, she's wearing the YouTube shirt. <laughs> Press the one. <laughs> oh, never mind. She, she didn't have to. Uh, she made it. That's her thrill ride for today. She didn't ride that Dollywood. I rode some bears and stuff. Yeah, well, maybe it's going to stop. Maybe. Well, she kept going lower. Maybe it's going to open. Are we witnessing her being stuck? Oh my gosh, I told her not to ride it. Uh, I figured it'd be like an old school feel. They said it would be, but it kind of smells old <laughs> and weird. <laughs> but, yeah. All right, so Jeremy's going to join us for story time right here. Um, I didn't, I'm in Tennessee right now, okay, and uh, well, that's some long hair, ain't it, man? Look at that, man. All right, anyway, look at my hair. No, I'm just kidding. All right, but um, last time I went, I, I didn't record a lot of, bunch of things happened, and, and uh, I went to this hotel. I don't know, I can't remember the name of it. It was just a cheap hotel we went to, and... I was joking around. I said, this place looks so old. Like, uh, I read a book about it and I was like, and I bet they give you actual keys instead of the cards for it. All right. Mom's in the car now. So she was there. Jeremy wasn't then, but I was joking around about them actually probably going to give us actual keys instead of cards. And they did. Well, all of a sudden we get on the elevator. So I don't know if I trust this. All of a sudden it acted up. Well, we get in our room later that night after we went to the Wildwood Grove opening and whatnot. And, um, Guys, it was like a scene straight from a horror movie or the Al Bundy show where they stayed in that hotel with the killer, okay? Because all of a sudden, me and mom, we sat there and there was straight up for like, I was watching Practical Jokers. We was like about to go to sleep. All of a sudden on the door, knock, 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 knock. And I'm like, okay, this is not room service. <laughs> room service? It wasn't that. They Okay, well, they kept knocking. Well, they stopped. Okay, about three minutes later, they come back, knocking again, like heavy, banging hard, okay? And then all of a sudden, we see them trying to move the, our, our, our door handle, and it's moving. I'm like, this part, they're trying to get in here with, with us. I'm like, there's an axe murderer. They're trying to kill us outside the hotel, okay? So after that, we go slowly. We turn the TV down to a creep. We, we didn't want to hear you know, the sound of the TV. And we reach over slowly to get to the, the pay phone. Or not the pay phone, but the telephone that's beside the thing. We lift it up to dial the number. And just like a scene from one of them movies or shows, the cord was ripped. I'm not even lying. So we go there trying to call. Well, then we're trying to find a number for the hotel on our modern day phones. And um, they weren't there at the time. So we waited out. Finally, they stop knocking, and we stop hearing people out there. We get some sleep, and uh, we was already thinking it was pretty shady. Come to find out, in the morning, we were looking for our key for the hotel, the actual key, because we didn't have a card to put in our wallets or anything like we usually do, that kind of key. We look, and we look. Finally, we open the door of the hotel, and guess what? Our key was inside the door. We left it in the handle like we do at the house sometimes. So... The people was probably just trying to tell us, hey, dummies, your key was in there. But we thought they were trying to kill us. So that we thought they were going to, they could have came in on us, but then they would have, they were probably scared too. They're like, oh, they're probably scared. They're going to shoot us with a gun, whatnot. It was a mutual thing. But anyways, we had left our key in the, the handle. So if somebody really wanted to come in and murder us, they could have. So that's pretty scary. Lord was watching over us. But that was, that was pretty intense. But that's my story, guys. And I, uh, Jeremy... How do you feel about that? <laughs> okay, but yeah, that's that was pretty wrong. 